Hello everybody, this is Sebo and on this video I want to show you this TV Mark Little 42 guitar head. Who's this amp for? This head is for all those players wanting a pretty simple and versatile amplifier with the right power to play on big stages and medium to small clubs as well. It's small and light, so it's a perfect choice if you want to save space and respect your back without compromising your real tube tone. In fact, this is an old tube class AB amplifier loaded with an ECC83 tube in the preamp section and an EL34 Duet plus an ECC83 in the power section. How many channels does it feature? We have two fully independent channels with separate gain, master volume, bass, middle and high controls. Then we have common presence and reverb controls. What about the back panel connections? On the back panel we got the serial effects loop sockets with a sand level switch, the optional two-way footswitch socket to switch between channels and activating reverb and of course the jack outputs to connect any cabinet with a 4 ohm minimum load. This amp also features a dual voltage selector letting it to adapt to different countries' voltages from 120 to 240 volts. Can I hear some examples on the clean channel? What makes this amp different is its dark voice that I really loved at the very first note. This is a new thread. It looks old, but it's not like a lot of modern Relic instrument. And we know brand new guitars are often bright sounding, harsh, too sparkling, so we need to crank up the bass controls and middle controls set to dramatically cut the high to get what we can define a normal sound. Just check out what's my EQ setting to get this really warm tone from my guitar. I also love the gain control behavior because it crunches up while I increase it, giving me a lovely muddy and punchy strat tone. What about the crunch channel? Just one channel sounding like that would be enough. But we have another one, so let's switch to the second channel, letting all the audience know it thanks to this amazing color changing DV Mark logo. How cool is that? Many players love to use mainly the clean channel, then they add overdrive or distortion pedal to get the dirty sound they need. Following this philosophy, the DV Mark Little 42 features an analog solid state drive stage as it was an actual distortion pedal placed after the clean channel. This crunch channel maintains the dark soul of this amp, offering a warm tone where we can start from a nice crunchy blue stone like this. Then we move it up, adding a more bite for a rock approved tone, really full and dynamic with any kind of guitar. Using the gain control all the way up, you can experiment an endless sustain and full punchy sound that's really typical only on higher gain amplifiers.
What's the DV Mark Lidl 42 weight? It's only around 20 pounds uh, and around 9.1 kilos. And if you need a very light rig, you can match it with a DV Mark DV Neo Classic cabinet, maybe a 412 or a 212 or maybe one or two 112 cabinets that perfectly fit the little 42 dimensions and power. Well, I guess you're amazed as I am every time I play this little 42. It's actually part of my live rig with my band and I really love it. So I suggest you to check it out at your local dealer, bring your guitar and enjoy it. Thanks a lot for watching. Ciao!